Born in Hong Kong. Up there. Go and ask the drunk up there, the alcoholic. It comes here, puts alcohol and lemonade cans, and it's been going on for months. There's also video camera of you drinking on a Sunday afternoon. Now you've been warned by the police. I've got photos can verify it. Don't talk to me. No, give him a go, Rhonda. Don't hog that's it. Right, that's right, yeah. Give him a go. Don't you talk about slander to me. Yeah, but he didn't slander you, Rhonda. And every time he the police arrive... He reckons you're a great woman. Every time the police arrive here when there's trouble here, like this episode, you disappear. You run and hide in the toilet. Most oh. rats hide in the toilet. And when I turn around... No, they're under man the bed. No man is a rat. The rats are under the bed. A man said that no man oh, is give a rat. Him a go, Rhonda. What I said to that is a rat by behaviour. A two-legged rat by behaviour. I didn't call him an individual rat. And that is what he's trying to do. See, she won't even let me respond. Yeah. She knows the reality. See, Rhonda, you... Yeah, you preach all this show. stuff about democracy, right? Yeah, and make ridiculous. money on the internet by selling movies here, so don't you talk to me about law and order. Now, you've just been exposed as a total fraud. An absolute fraud. Members of the because this guy wanted to respond and you didn't let him behavior, talk. And your because if your argument can't stand up to it... If I don't know it. what I'm talking about, I'll close the meeting. How's that? No, if you don't... Why don't, you let, him, why don't you let him it's correct closed. you? It's finished. OK, see you later. Now you can have his safe. Right, Speak up. So it isn't closed. And I'll tell you why it ain't closed. She's accusing me of pretending to be an Aboriginal person. Would you ask any black fella that I've ever spoken to whether I have insinuated that I have Aboriginal blood in me? And they will say no, because I haven't. And I won't. I won't for two reasons. One, if I did that, I would be dishonouring our beautiful people, who I have a lot of respect for. And two, I'm very proud of my Irish ancestors. And I'm also proud of my English ancestors. And I don't wear this shirt to pretend to be Aboriginal. I wear this shirt to remind you all and myself that this is Aboriginal land. Yeah, Not yeah. Victoria. This is Wurundjeri country. That's right. And she talks about the law. She says, this is public land. If you don't shut up, I'll call the police. But I ask you this. That's true. Now whether they broke their treaties or not, whether the people that they made the treaties with are any better off is another question. They did not sign one single treaty with any Aboriginal nations on this land. You're right. Rhonda agrees with you there. But I want to know, when are we going to stop living in denial? And when are we going to do the right thing? Not just by our people, but by us. And when are we going to stop lying? Stop jumping up and down and accusing people of things they haven't done. 
That's right. Wrong. They only came How once. They only came so once. Why should I disappear? That's right. No. It's not looking for me. It's not that I care whether they are or not. That's another issue. They just came for a social call. Just have a chat. Well done, well spoken. Dude.